He vanished without a trace. It's been almost two decades since a Valley teen disappeared while walking to a party in his Phoenix neighborhood. Team 12's Trisha Hendricks spoke with a boy's sister who says she will never give up hope. It is very odd, the feelings of, of him not being around. Heartbroken, Veronica Alvarado speaks with 12 News about the disappearance of her 14-year-old brother, Jesse Flores. It's a struggle. It's indescribable. The way we have to go through the holidays without him. Veronica wants to know what happened to her little brother, who went missing after leaving for a party on the evening of September 14th, 2001. Turned around, said, I love you, Mom. I'll see you in a little while. But Jesse never made it home. A search has been underway ever since. This age progression image shows what Jesse could look like today at 33 years old. I know he would be a successful young man in everything he did. He was a leader. He was independent. He was so charismatic and we miss him dearly. Veronica hopes by sharing the pain her family is still going through, perhaps new leads will come in, that there will be a renewed effort to track him down. We hope that wherever you lie your head, that you are being safe. One day our prayers will be answered, whether it be here on earth or in heaven, we'll get a closure at some, at some point in our lives. In Phoenix, Trisha Hendricks. 12 News. If you have any information about Jesse's disappearance, call Phoenix Police or the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children at 1-800-THE-LOST.